Good afternoon, Rio Hondo. My name is Matt Lopez, and I'm here in the Rio Hondo parking lot where it's been nothing but traffic and headaches. And today we're going to get a good scope of how the student body feels about this. And we didn't have to walk far to find two students who had something to say about the parking situation. Here I'm with, with Esmeralda and Yadi. And I heard you were just talking to me before that it took you about an hour to find parking today. Yes, we actually came around 9 to find parking because our class didn't start till 9.40. But we had a look around the whole entire lot and we did not find parking till like an hour later. So for like a whole hour, you're just out here searching around back and forth. And you both paid for parking passes? Yes. So how does that make you feel to know that even if you pay for a parking pass, you're still not guaranteed a spot? It makes us upset because we've been missed class, so um, we're still missing out on our education. Yeah, and it's like the first day, so I'm sure everything is like really important on the yes. first day, right? Well, is there anything that you two would do or anything you could suggest for the, any uh, administration watching? Um, I don't know. More parking lots. <laughs> I don't know. It's, it gets frustrating because then there goes all my gas. Yeah, right? Because I went around the whole, like, the whole school and everything. And we didn't go around once. We went around. Well, I'll let you guys get back to your class. Thank you very much for talking with me today. Have a great day. Hi, now I'm here with Matthew. Uh, Matthew, you were just telling me earlier that you actually parked way down in the FedEx lot about a football field and a half away rather than even trying to find a parking spot in here. Now, why is that? It's just easier to get back home. Not, not have to deal with the Just come to park down there and just have you ever actually bought a parking pass before and then yeah. you come over here and there's no parking? Yeah, you're driving around for a long time. How does that make you feel that even though you buy a parking pass, you're not guaranteed a parking spot? Um, it sucks because you get late to your classes, so that's... Um... Now, is there anything that you might suggest for whoever runs this? Mm, selling less parking passes, maybe? Selling less parking passes? Yeah, the only, I mean, like, only the amount of spaces they have. That's true. Just... That would be a good idea. Well, thank you for your time. Fred. Hi Fred, so how long have you been driving this for? A little over three years. Three years. And uh, is parking always as crazy as it's been the past two days? Uh, it's actually not too bad. I thought it'd be worse. Really? So compared to the past years, it's just nothing? Uh, probably about, I don't know, maybe 80, 85% of what I normally is, I think. What's the, what's the most common complaint you get on here? Is there another bus or are you the only one? <laughs> <laughs> Why did I say that? I don't know, I guess. I don't know if they, maybe they seem to be going around repeatedly or just seems like, yeah, I don't know. No. I don't know, I don't even know. Well, it's good to know that this hasn't been the worst semester. What was that? It's good to know that this hasn't been the worst semester of parking. Yeah. And uh, I appreciate you talking to us today. I'm the Rio Honda News parking lot. <laughs>